What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my Christ subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash this up and be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading uh, for all signs, cap through side to everybody in between. Don't forget basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys so very much. Uh, I appreciate all the new subscribers, all the love and support to my channel. If you think anyone else would like my channel, please feel free to share it very publicly on social media and word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. Love you guys so very much. It's 7.22 p.m. 12-16-2022. Hope everybody's doing well. Okay, so I received a channeling. We're just going to tap right into it. Hope everybody's doing well. Okay, so the channel message I received was... Um, <clears throat> A Scorpio masculine in his 30s and a Scorpio feminine in her 20s. I heard they both work um, in healthcare in the 3D workspace. Um, I heard through many series of chain events, very significant, and I heard a lot of them, patient complaints are about to come in on them. Um, I heard they're very good shapeshifters. Um, they're very, very good at getting out of... Um, Bad, bad customer situations but through many series of chain events there is about to be a lot of patient complaints from everywhere okay there's about to be a lot of patient complaints from everywhere um so um they work in healthcare, so they are around patients in some shape form or fashion but there's about to be a lot of patient complaints from everywhere so it sounds like all over the place um but they're very good shapeshifters meaning they're very they are good at transmuting energy they're good at shifting the energy from negative to positive to go in their favor basically that's basically transmuting of energy for anybody who doesn't know that um they're very good at it but um it's not going to save them this time and for one they will end up losing their job it's going to be that bad and for one, it's going to go very downhill for them. Okay, for one, it's going to be so bad they're going to end up losing their job. And for one, it's going to go downhill for them, I guess, in their career or job or what have you, what have you. Um, sounds like a, um, they work in the medical field. So I don't, you know, there's many different occupations in the medical field. Many. Um, so whatever that is, but some kind of patient complaint, many of them. There's at least two in the universe, and um, uh, in his 30s, Scorpio masculine, and in her 20s, Scorpio femme. They could have Scorpio in any aspects of their charts, sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, and Midhaven, Jupiter charts. But I heard one of them's going to end up losing their job over this. One, their career is going to go downhill in a um, negative way. So you plug it in how it resonates. Oh, my God. They're going to wish they never poked their nose in a family's business in the past. This is about to be huge negative karma for them. Huge. Okay, I heard they're going to wish they never poked their nose in a family's business in the past. This is about to be huge negative karma for them. Huge. So, sounds like they poked their nose in a family's business where it didn't belong in the past. Whoever um, these Scorpios are, there's at least two of them. They work in healthcare, both of them. Message of concern on the bottom of the deck. Um, Scorpio masculine in his 30s and a Scorpio femme in her 20s. Um, whoever these people are. Spirit messages you have to Set in wealth. I heard take it. Number 11 could be very significant. Number one, five. Number 11. Mature man upright, number five, could be very significant number in one's life, number five. I heard take it, family room reverse, number 21, could be very significant number in one's life, number 21. We have 11, five, or 21.
Message of concern again, number 14. It could be a very significant number in one's life, number 14. These people had no business in a family's life in the past. No business. And through many series of chain of events, the power of the people are about to pick up on these negative energies in their workplace. They're about to complain on them in huge ways. Huge ways. And the family, the head of household feminine family member that they poked their nose in where they shouldn't have belonged, in the past, through many series of chain of events, this person is about to receive a very large amount of money. They do not want this person to have it, but they are about to have it. It's a feminine energy. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Okay, so these two people, they both work in the medical profession in some shape, form, or fashion. The Fems in her 20s and the masculines in his 30s, both Scorpios. Um, they basically poke their nose in a family's business where they shouldn't have belonged in the past. And it's a Fem head of household, um, head of the family, it sounds like. And I think she has one or two or two plus kids. But uh, it sounds like they negatively affected the family. And it sounds like their negative karma is about to be patients of theirs. They're about to care for in the energetic space. That's about to pick up on... They're bad ways, basically. Um, I guess at work or other. I'm assuming at work because it's going to be at work when they complain on them. Because it sounds like they're going to take care of them as patients. Um, and these people that are going to take care of them as patients, they know that they messed with this family in the past. So it's going to create like a negative snowball effect of basically um, patient complaints is what it sounds like on them in a, a medical profession, um, whatever, wherever they work in the um, energetic space as far as medical profession. They are about to receive so many of them. They are about to receive so many of them. They are about to receive so many of them, so many complaints. So, um, and the fem energy that they met, fem energy had a household that they messed with in the past. I heard she's about to receive a very large amount of money. So, um, message of concern is the patient complaints in this aspect. Um, I think this is the fem energy about to receive the very large amount of money um, that they messed with in the past. Fem, fem energy had a household. Um, set in wealth, very large amount of money. Um, family in reverse, maybe she doesn't stay at home or the or the, maybe they broke up the family uh, for some kind of strategic money reasons possibly or other reasons. Um, or they can't mess or harm the family like they did in the past. But they definitely did in the past. They poked their nose in the family's business where they it didn't belong, basically. And it's not their business. And that's just the truth. So a mature man, I think a mature masculine energy is about to um, have a hand in getting giving her this um, large amount of money, whatever this is. I don't know if it's a settlement, a payout, a... Um, inheritance, uh, whatever, whatever, whatever. Trust fund energy, whatever it is. This mature masculine energy definitely has a hand in it. Okay, I heard this mature masculine energy definitely has a hand in this. Yeah, he definitely has a hand in it. So for some, you could be this mature masculine energy about to help this fem energy head a household that had her, that had these, the, at least two Scorpios in the universe that work in the medical profession mess with her and her family in a huge way, basically poked their nose where it didn't belong. In the first place, um, you plug it in where it resonates. But whatever, if you're the fem energy head of household about to receive this money, it's a large amount of money, ma'am. You, you're pulling up setting wealth upright. And I heard these people, these two, at least two Scorpios in the universe, so one in their masculine in his 30s and the fem in her 20s, they don't want you to have it. They don't want you to have it. But there's a mature masculine energy that has a hand or is about to have a hand in um either helping you get this large amount of money or some kind of hand in helping you get this money. Um, for, I feel you are owed this money. You are definitely owed this money. 
All right, it's confirmation. You're definitely owed this money. Yeah, you're definitely owed this money. But he's about to become a power play mover and helping you get it. That's what it sounds like. And you can be mature and be any age, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75. It's not about physical age. It's about mental maturity here. Okay? All right, I'm closing this out. I love you guys so much, and I'm going to stay.